Hi, this is Marty from Blue Lightning TV. I'm going to show you how to create a natural, multicolored tattoo. When you find the design you like, make sure it's in black and white and add it to your layers panel. To save some time, I've already cut out and separated each part of the tattoo that's going to receive a different color. So we have this section will be one color, then we'll add that, that'll be a second, a third, and a fourth color. In addition, I've also cut out and saved the necklace as well. We'll zoom into the area using our magnify tool and go into the clone stamp tool and retouch out the necklace so we have a nice clean area of the skin to apply our tattoo on. We'll go to the layers panel and open up the tattoo folder. Press control as you click on the top layer then shift click as you click on each of the layers below it. Doing this will call up each of the selections we click on. The end result is a selection that will encompass the entire tattoo. Press Ctrl L or Command L on a Mac to open up the levels panel. Slide the input and output levels to get the contrast and brightness you'd like. We'll now adjust the color of the tattoo so go to the tattoo folder and open it up and Ctrl click on one of the layers. That will open up the selection and then adjust the hue to a color you like. We'll change the color of another part of the tattoo by control clicking on a different layer. Click control H to hide the selection then control U to call up the hue saturation and adjust the color of that as well. We'll control click on the last part of the tattoo to adjust the color and when we're satisfied press OK. Now that we've changed the colors of each part of the tattoo, we're going to finesse the brightness and saturation of all the colors together. To do that, we need to call up a selection of the entire tattoo. We'll retrieve the selection of the entire tattoo again and click Ctrl H or Command H on a Mac to hide the selection. We'll click Ctrl U or Command U on a Mac to get the saturation just right. We'll click Control L or Command L on a Mac to bring up the Levels panel and adjust the input levels for the right brightness and contrast. We'll bring back the necklace now, so we'll go to the Layers palette and click the eyeball back on on the necklace. To make the necklace look more natural on the tattoo, we'll start painting in shadows under the necklace on the tattoo. So we'll go to Brush, Multiply, and bring down the opacity a bit. We'll adjust the size of our brush and start brushing in the shadows. You can create your own digital tattoos with as many colors as you like. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to Blue Lightning TV on YouTube. There you'll find great tutorials, tips and tests in Photoshop and After Effects.